Hello, Charles Dickens Elementary School in Vancouver, British Columbia. Greetings to all you students who are watching this. I am uh, intrigued by your question. I'm absolutely intrigued by it because it's something that we have to deal with. How do we get rid of the use of fossil fuels and change them to something else? Well, you know, um, hang on. Is it raining over there? If it is, when those raindrops hit the ground, do they make a kind of a splat or a splash? Could that be a form of energy that's being created in that splash? Well, I don't know because I'm just a politician and I, I, I don't know about things like this. Your mom and dad will say that I'm one of the most useless people on this earth because I'm a politician. They might be right. I don't know. But there are people out there who specialize in asking that question. What if? Is there energy there? How can we use it? Can we convert that splash of a raindrop hitting the ground into something that will make the buses and trains and planes and cars go? I don't know. But one thing that all those scientists need is they need money to fund their thinking, to, to, to help them to come up with the answers. And that's where this useless politician comes in because I can provide that money. And that's what the Canadian Action Party wants to do. That's my party. What we want to do is to fund the scientists to come up with the answers that will make a difference in your future. So when you go to someone and say, when we get rid of fossil fuels, what are we going to use? They will say this.